Oh boy, I can't wait to get back home. But I can't get back home without knowing the way. Or can I? Oh, <laughs> hey, mister. Uh, do you know the way to one... Uh, oh, wow. Uh, you want a hug? Or, uh, okay. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Wow, it's, it's pretty cold in here and dark, too. Leave me alone. I'm busy. Everything's important to someone. If there's a kid running around unattended, the Shadow Man probably has him by now. Oh, you really are in over your head. Oh, you are clever. But I don't know him. Nobody does. If you stay a spell... All Marjorie Took can tell you about him. The Shadow Man. He was born in the time of the first nightmare, and he lives on to this day. But not like you or I. He lives in the walls, the walls of Mulgro Alley. And he can always see you, but you can only see him when it's dark. Snuff out the lights in Mulgro Alley, and you'll find him there, waiting. But be warned, child. It may be the last thing you see. If he were merely a ghost, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Goodbye. I do not think we will see each other again. Even suddenly felt like she was being watched. And to tell you the truth, I did too. One. Okay, fair enough. Uh, have you seen a little boy? About yay high? Let me think. Uh, this one? Oh, wow, even is that you? I'm so glad to see you. Can you believe that I'm stuck? Let him out! may be true, but there is another truth. That if you're not afraid now, you'll soon learn to be. Haven't you heard the bedtime stories? I'm what goes bump in the night. I'm what comes for children when they roam a little too far from home. This is what I do. Or what I used to do anyway. Before this silly war. He's mine now. I won't be letting him go. I believe you'd call that leverage. Think you'd know not to insult someone who's holding all the cards. Or in this case, children. Besides, you don't have what I need. Nothing you have, child. And I suspect nothing you can bring me. That remains to be seen. But perhaps you're right. I want the same thing all of us want here. Peace. I want the Triplet's War to end. Oh, I'm not. I'm the creature that moves in the dark type. 
people only truly fear things that move in the dark during peace. During war, they are surrounded by greater threats all day long. And so nobody fears the Shadow Man anymore. Life is a greater horror. And they have overindulged, forgotten me. If you want me to give you a nod, then I want you to change that. I don't care how. I don't care about anything even. Except being feared by everyone again. I've watched you. I know you're a dice wielder. Silence! Don't insult me with your bloody lies! They may work on the living, but you can't deceive the Shadow Man. You alone carry the power to affect the arenas and those giant robots. Figure it out, or you will never see your precious Bernard or any other child I choose to take again. Without peace, there will be no boy, no hope, and you will never see your sister again. For you, there are currently more important questions at stake. Go, even. Bernie's fate rests on your tiny shoulders. And my hunger won't be held at bay forever. To save Bernard from the wretched Shadow Man, even had to end Threedom's civil war. It was a hard task. An impossible task. But she wasn't going to let her friend die. The first thing she needed was information. Perhaps some of the locals would be willing to share what they knew. Oh, you're burning daylight, even. And I don't think I like what I see. Indeed we do. But you'd better. The boy is growing cold in here. Let's hope it's time you have, young even. to this child soon, when his body is, at last, as cold as mine. disgraced your father's beloved freedom so, and how proud he was of you. But bloody this is just not how he raised you. <laughs> Listen, I was there that doomed night when your father was murdered. And Nishka the bodyguard recounted vividly what had happened that night. It was a tale of a god lady gone awry, of a blade against mechanical arm, and a cold-blooded murder. I was going to roll my dice. Well, that's how fights were done in those days. 
but this murderer didn't play by the rules. My trusty arm was cut off. I returned the favor and tore off the perpetrator's finger. And that perpetrator was the Shadow Man. Busted. Bernie! Oh, hey, even there you are. I should have been there to guide you all. I went mad with guilt for failing your father, and I ran away. I am so sorry. Ahem. It appears that this war might have been for naught. This war was all because you three never talked to each other? You people are the worst!